gonna tell you this right now. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna punch this camera and I'm gonna punch it across the street. The audio isn't good. <sighs> Boy, I tell you. So, um, I'm in the middle of building a rolling butcher's cart for the kitchen, but I'm not sure why, but I know, cause I know why it didn't happen, because I didn't reset the oil service thing in the Tiguan. But anyways, I'm gonna change the oil because this probably has close to 3,000, 3,000, 3,500 miles. I'm gonna do the oil now. Um, I had to let the car cool down because it was burning hot. So we're gonna do the oil. I got an air filter. Just picked one up from ST from AutoZone STP. No big deal. I'm not worried about it. Later on, I'll get like a K&N or something a little bit better. Um, I also want to do LED headlights. If it cools down a little bit, lens tint. Um, and then chrome delete stuff. And then maybe I'll, I still have to look for the rack tool to take the racks off so I can wrap those in vinyl. So we're going to do a lot of work on the take on today. And then later on, I'll be, I'm not sure if I'll make a video. I didn't make a video, so I'm not going to do anything with this, but I got to get back on this. Okay, so we've all, I've done, I don't even know how many at this point, and you've seen hundreds and hundreds of doing oil changes on a take one. So I'm just going to do the oil, swap out the filter, and then get to the cool stuff that we really want to see. Just a quick side by side of the filters. Brand new, nice and clean. This one, not terribly dirty, but it's dirty. I mean, the car only has 70. 70,000 miles give or take so I didn't get the cabin filter but that's gonna be next I'm gonna change that on and the air filter on the GLI probably next week as well just do them both that way you know keeps your AC nice and healthy when you get all the crap out of there and besides the engine base so dusty I'll probably do a little cleaning and clean this up because I'm not sure she doesn't drive much but very dusty some people have asked, and I guess I'll say now, I've told them, but the reason why I use an aftermarket magnetic drain plug is when you're trying to changing the oil, if you see any shards or any metal bits here and there, you could probably tell or start to look in if your engine is having any issues or any trouble. Um, so far, since I've done it with these two cars, no issues. Um, I just changed the oil right now, and there was no shards or anything, no even specks or flecks in the oil or on the drain plug so it's a good idea to have it that way as the oil's running around if there's any metal shavings metal shavings in your oil it'll pick it up so oil's been changed and everything's in here i think i'm gonna just do a mild wash down with the regular hose since my neighbor has my pressure washer and obviously i don't have access to it found you found you i thought i had to buy one now they're only 40 dollars, but why 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 i found it so i'm gonna take the racks off wipe them down bring them inside wrap them and then put them back on later i didn't show the process because i didn't know exactly how i was going to do it but look how good that came out I'm happy. No, it's not 100% perfectly smooth. So all I got to do now is post heat it. And then that looks way better than having ratty old looking crossbars. Not bad.
you're done. Nice, real nice. Now, she left with the Tiguan, so there's nothing else for me to do. Tomorrow, I will get on the Chrome Delete, put these back on, these are gonna look fire, and then smoke the lenses tomorrow as well. This will all be just one big, huge video. So, see you guys tomorrow.